let's get ready to sketch a profile what I'm going to do is select this plane this is the YZ plane once I click on it now I can go to the right of the screen and select the sketcher icon this is it once I select it I'm in a sketcher mode and I can start making the profile I'm going to go to our predefined profiles and I'm going to click on the rectangle now I will click on, on the left side release the mouse button drag to the right drag down release the mouse button and click once more and now what I'm going to do is give this give this line some dimensions and I'm also going to give dimensions to this line I'm going to the right of the screen I'm gonna select the constraint I'm gonna select this line I'm going to click again I want this to be 100 units so I'm going to go to the constraint definition type in 100 and hit OK once I do that I'm gonna take care of this line now I'm gonna go once again to the right of the screen select the constraint select the line drag it to the right and give it some dimension by double clicking on it I'm gonna select 100 units again okay it's looking real good what I just did I just selected this line held down the mouse button and I was able to move this around the screen what I also want to do is select this line and this line and allow symmetry across this axis and select this line and this one and select and allow geometry uh, symmetry across this axis here so I'm gonna go back to the constraint I'm gonna select this line this line I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna select allow symmetry line and I'm gonna select vertical axis so now they are both equally spaced away from the vertical axis I'm gonna do it to these horizontal lines as well I'm gonna come right here I'm gonna select this this right click allow symmetry line and select the horizontal axis now my sketch is fully constrained it's green and uh, green means it's fully constrained uh, we are making a tube that's made out of steel I have never seen a tube that had 100% you know like 90 degree angles here okay there's some kind of a fillet on it somewhere sometime most of the time actually so I'm gonna go under operation in the left lower corner of my screen and I'm gonna select corner and I'm gonna select either the first curve and then second curve of a, or a common point the common point is right here so I'm gonna click on it I'm gonna release the mouse button and drag a little bit down now I'm gonna get a radius or a fillet I'm gonna select with the left mouse button now I got this question do I want to proceed and you know convert the length of the first selected element into distance yes definitely okay see now I got a little radius now 21.21 is way the heck up too much I want to drag those dimensions off to the side double click on them and make them about five and I'm gonna hit OK again all right I got a nice radius you can't see it right now but I'm gonna go under visualization and turn off everything except for diagnostics see pretty good radius all right I, tr I turn them back on now I'm gonna go to another corner create another radius and another radius and another radius okay so I'm gonna click on the comment point once again I'm gonna drag it to the inside I'm gonna select yes and I'm gonna drag the dimensions to the outside the only reason why I'm doing it is just so it looks nicer 
I'm going to double click on those dimensions and select five and I'm going to hit OK. And I got a nice fillet. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to create another one. I'm going to select the comment point. I'm going to drag it to the inside. I'm going to drag the dimensions to the outside. Double click on it, select five, and hit OK again. One more to go. The last one will be done differently. I'm going to select the fillet select the first line, the second line, and drag this little bit to the inside. And I'm going to click. Boom. Drag the dimensions to the outside, double click on it, punch in 5, and hit OK again. Kabuto. Now we have a nice profile. What I'm going to do now is exit the sketcher, and now we can start playing with this.